Welcome back, boys and girls. This is your boy Ryan Fu, aka Mr. Fu, with another video. We're going to switch it up and talk about who is Justin Jijeka, aka the human Ken doll. Yes, this man is basically a uh, human Ken doll. He's made of plastic, all right? Uh, he's had well over 700 cosmetic surgeries. Yes, seven, zero, zero, hundy cosmetic surgeries. Uh, if you check out the channel and just type his name in, you'll see all the videos we've had with him. Um, he, he talks about the plastic surgeries, the benefits, the downsides, just everything that's going on with him, you know, in and around uh, why he did the surgeries, uh, how he feels afterwards, why he did them. You can just check out uh, all his thoughts about them in the uh, videos um, on this channel. But I really wanted to go down who Justin Jakey is besides being known as the human Ken doll. And I, I've got the, um, the pleasure to interview this man uh, just, you know, a handful of times. It's always been a pleasure and I think who he is is just a really, really uh, down to earth nice guy. You know, every time I've uh, come up to him and just, you know, seen him, he's always down to do an interview, give his time, give his thoughts about his surgeries and what's going on with him and just, you know, other other newsworthy um, stuff going around the world. He always gives time and I think I think people should know, like, he, deep down he's like a really nice guy and if you were a fan, he always stops by, greets his fans and like takes selfies with them. And another thing, I like how he, he doesn't get the negativity get to him, alright? I've noticed there's a lot of haters on YouTube and the internet that like dogs this man for all the um, the plastic surgeries he's uh, gotten uh, over the years. But you know he doesn't let the haters get to him. All right, and I know there's a lot of haters, but you know Justin, I give him credit. He is always a positive person and doesn't let the negativity get to him just always just believes what he's doing is right and he's just always gonna be you know positive and just have an, uh, an upbeat and happy attitude about that and I think that's really important especially when you're like you know doing the not normal you know this is not normal what a uh, getting 700 cosmetic plastic surgeries but uh, you know he understands that, and you know he always has a um, positive attitude about it. And uh, you know I, I I like that. You know he's always positive. He's always nice. I think I think that's who he really is. You know I think he wants to like show the world like hey you, you could do all these uh, cosmetic surgeries, but I think deep downside you are the person who you are inside. You know I don't know what I'm trying to say, but I'm trying to say he's a really nice guy. Um, so if you ever want to see him, greet him, he'll tell you say selfie, but he's a really nice guy, that's who he is. Uh, the following video is, uh, me interviewing him, him with his, uh, adorable mom. Check out this video coming up right here. Uh, if you like this, How's like, going, subscribe, bro? hope you guys are safe. Check Looking you guys great. Out. Peace. Thank you, thank you. Give me your fitness tips besides, you know, surgery. <laughs> what do you do to stay this immaculate? <laughs> Botox. Very <laughs> fillers. Um, I don't know, hydrate. <laughs> Just water. Water all day. And I have good genetics. This is my mom, Tanya. Oh, look at that. Good genetics. Nice, nice. Hey, what are your thoughts of, uh, you know, Calvin Jenner just, just came out, like, recently. We'll give her a grade so far, or, like, you know. A grade? Yeah, like, what a... Well, I don't know that Caitlyn Jenner's actually been out. But Kate, right, Caitlyn has transitioned. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> um, uh, I know, I think, I think that what she's doing is a great thing, obviously, for the transgender community. I mean, okay. it's bringing awareness to it and showing people that, you know, being a transsexual individual doesn't necessarily have to be intertwined also with sexual orientation. And I think she's made that very clear, and I think that's an interesting part of the story hmm. that a lot of people haven't necessarily 
um, focused on at this point. So I like that she's keeping those things separate so you don't confuse uh, the majority of, gotcha. of the audience. Yeah, yeah. Hey, what are, your, what are your thoughts of your son like getting all these surgeries? What, are you all, apparently you're all right with it, right? I, I wasn't, I guess, originally. <laughs> Right. Is it? Is it? That's awesome. Is there anything like he could do? You know, like maybe get like a face tattoo. Where's your limit? Where's your limit? You're like, no, you're not getting that. <laughs> That's my sister's thing. She's the tattoo one. Okay. Yeah. She knows I would take her in consideration, but if I to do that, that's beautiful. Exactly. That is the truth. Thanks so much, guys. Thanks, you guys have a blessed day. Appreciate it. What's going on, guys? It's Ryan Fu. If you guys enjoyed that video, please smash that like button and also hit that notification bell next to the subscribe button so you guys could be up to date with all our videos. So once again, smash that like button and hit that notification bell next to the subscribe button and check you guys out later and keep on shocking them, bros.